amidst COVID and everything else, we were uh, able to launch this uh, carpentry camp program this summer. And it was so fun. We had um, six people come, three who stayed over in our backyard in tents, uh, and, um, and, uh, and then three who just came during the day. And uh, we had been donated a trailer um, for, uh, from a, uh, somebody who had been trying to build a tiny house and uh, kind of was a, got a little overwhelmed. And so she was like, you know, here, why don't you take this trailer, take all the materials. So we deconstructed the whole thing. And then, um, and then with these six participants, we said, okay, now it's your turn to design your tiny house. And they we're like, oh, I, you know, I want to have the bar window here, and I, and I, the shower will be over here, and they just like got so into it, and so we built up this tiny house uh, with a, a little like a, I had a miniature second story, uh, in a matter of a week, and it was mostly just focused on the carpentry aspects, and that was the key of the camp anyway, was to focus on how do you frame, how do you sheathe, you know, how do you build a roof, how do you attach all those things securely. And then at the end of the week, we took the whole thing apart and then we ran the camp again. Um, and so next summer, we're gonna be doing the same thing and that scholarship money is gonna to go to help folks be able to attend who otherwise wouldn't be able to attend. The people who are really excited and who, and who reach out about scholarship funds have such interesting stories. And it's so, it just is so wonderful to be able to support them and then say, yes, you can come. And, um, and they just, they're just up to such great things that it's really nice to be able to support that.